Feeling a little depressed? Kind of like nothing's really going your way? Feeling as though the whole world hates you? Don't worry, I've been there. And you know, sometimes it could be the negativity that surrounds you every single day. And then sometimes it's just you. Telling you that you fucking suck. You gotta learn to love thyself. No. That, that's that's not what I meant at all. I meant you gotta build confidence. You gotta develop self-esteem. How does one do this? I'm glad you asked. For starters, stop focusing on things you can't control. For example, I've got an enormous head, okay? I know this. And it's one of the biggest, pardon the pun, insecurities I have. But there's nothing I can do about it. So I just try to look at the silver lining. God obviously gave me a big head for a reason. In case I need to headbutt a motherfucker in the face. <laughs> Don't get too close, bitch, I'm lethal. Stop getting depressed and complaining about things that you suck at. Have you tried to improve on the things that you suck at? No? Well then there's your fucking problem. With the right amount of dedication and commitment, you can damn near develop any skill you want. Take my best friend Matt, for example. About 10 years ago, he had two left feet when it came to dancing. I mean, the dude had no rhythm whatsoever. None. But now, he's made progress. Very little progress, but progress nonetheless. The point is, you have to realize your potential. You are not a piece of shit. You are the shit. You have to channel what I like to call your ism. What's an ism, you ask? Fuck should I know, I just made that shit up. No, for real. Ism as in your inner sexy mode. Your inner sexy mode is a constant reminder of how awesome and incredible you are. We're all sexy in our own way. And we all have that inner switch inside of us that when turned on makes us feel powerful, liberated, and most of all, sexy. Hey, shoot. But you see, some of you guys can't hear your inner sexy calling you because you're too surrounded by all this negativity that keeps telling you that you're either too fat or too skinny or too stupid. And that couldn't be further from the truth. Growing up, I always thought that the odds were stacked against me. As a kid, I was teased a lot. Girls didn't like me, I couldn't play any sports, I wasn't all that smart in school, and my head to body ratio was all fucked up, man. <laughs> but over time I stopped listening to the naysayers and started listening to my ism, and before long I was able to look in the mirror and say, oh, bam. So if you're ever lacking confidence, or feeling a little depressed or worthless, just do what I do, and turn that ism switch on. My name's James. Andrew. I'm James. And the M stands for... Uh! It's all about just thinking positive. And if you master this way of thinking, you'll be able to master pretty much anything. <laughs> Stop with that. Seriously. That's not what I meant. Anyway, I'm your boy Tactics. Peace. And I'm out. Nigga, <laughs> that shit was so good, I'm still coming, man.